Hey there, everyone. Welcome to another Let's Play Twilight Princess HD. I'm Samuel. I'm Sue. And we've got a big cannon. Who do we know that deals with big cannons? Oh, I know. <laughs> Funny guy. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> oh, ah. I, I can do that. I think you got that many. Right where we need to go. Yeah. Holy crap. Wow. Bet you're going to have to fight that thing. <laughs> no, it's just going to be a random story point in which nothing's going to happen and I'll be safe. <laughs> He's running away. <laughs> Shop up here. Whoa. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it looks like they got everything you'd need. Problem is, I don't have any empty bottles or anything, or I'd take them up on it. Couple of chests. 
Where? Over there. The end. Oh. Two of them. There are. Hmm. Oh, you, I figured you'd seen this. No, you, you never make assumptions when it comes okay. to me and seeing things. <laughs> you should have learned this at this <laughs> point. <laughs> So apparently you're going to need water bombs. Probably. is a different place thing. Yep, so there's a cannon on the other side to get me back down. This is the way to go inside. But yes, this one's an interesting one. It's difficult though, so. Mm. Oh, you got him. crap I can do. Okay. Let's, I'll push you on this one this time. Oh, you can fly with them. I forgot about that. Well, we knew that with chickens, but... That's the sort of learn-it-as-you-go thing, but that makes logical sense given they've got wings. And there's a whole bunch of them everywhere. <laughs> walked up the wall. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> ah, shoot! Oh. Dang thing. I meant to throw the shell back at him and... <laughs> That's what I meant to do. It amazes me you don't know where to go in these games. These things are logically built to go a certain direction. I just... See, any way I finish that sentence is going to sound like an insult to you, so I'm just going to no. shut up right now. Okay. <laughs> You're too hard on yourself. There we go. That's that's what I was intending to come up with. Yeah, okay. See, I don't remember how to deal with Big Boy here. I'm sure I can deal with Big Boy, to be perfectly honest. You have to get him where the suit's not, ain't you? Yeah, but the suit's everywhere. What's the problem? Unless... I'm having to think of my whole arsenal here. Which is difficult to do while you were... Where are you? There you are. Okay, no. I thought maybe that would be the thing to deal with heavily armored stuff, but... Okay, what was there? I think you're breathing into the microphone again, Mom. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> I was really into that. Uh-huh. That's, that's why I specifically said it, because I was like, eh, I 
think she's just too busy watching this. I don't think big boy there can be taken care of yet. And that's probably why. For the time being, there is a door at least, so let's go through it. You kind of check a room to see if there's puzzles already in it, but... I tried getting him from the back end. That's the first thing I tried. Done Dun good. Not since Mario Party have we had to tap this much in them. And now the wind's getting you. <laughs> ah, requires a key. Yeah. Don't have a key yet. Probably gonna have to kill that armadillo. <laughs> Hope not. <laughs> Probably will out of principle, of course, but <laughs> no, I suspect he's there just as a, because I'm going to be honest, I remember nothing about this dungeon. This is one of the ones where it's got a complexity level off the charts, and as a result, actually remembering where anything is, is pretty much not happening. Can you run him on one of those blue things? Take him down. It might, I mean, but... you're requiring and I don't I don't have it yet it's in here but I don't have it yet <laughs> The 
it seriously does feel like the Mario Party days <laughs> of just having to tap, 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 tap. I think mean, I'll put it up to the mic so you can hear this. Oh, yeah. Back over. your key. Yeah, there's the key for the one door. Okay, what else? What else can we achieve <gasps> here? You should have known you'd jump it off of that to your death. <laughs> no, I thought I could jump across to the thing. Thank you very okay. much. <laughs> <laughs> that seemed like enough of a gap. Especially considering above there, that was the trap. <laughs> There's a red thing on the bottom. Yeah, there is, but I think I'm going to have to come back to this room for it later. Yeah. So you could go down there, then come up there, and then... See, I know what's coming. You don't. So wow, there are a lot of aspects... That's true. There are a lot of aspects of this dungeon. I would dungeon have, that have been killed several times, probably. I remember what new tool is inside of this. Spoiler alert, I've made this coy reference to it in the past. Uh, if, if I do that whenever I'm on the bridge, I'm dead. If the wind shows up while I'm on the bridge, I'm dead, that is. Wow. I think I think they know we're here. <laughs> do you they do, too. do you do you get that distinct impression? Yes, I think you're in trouble. It was the other side that had the key, I think, right? Or was it this one? Mm, you've went in so many doors, I couldn't tell you. Yeah, I know. Me too. <laughs> uh. No, oh, yeah, it's the other one. This one has some interesting stuff, and it's got a boss battle beyond belief. But 
otherwise, this this dungeon has a couple of things where it's just like, okay, fine, I've got to do that. <laughs> It's one of those where it makes you work for it, like like the Water Temple did. People that played Ocarina of Time, I think I've told you about this one before. I hated the Water Temple because it had that feel to it. I feel like this one has similar of a feel to it. Mm. Although you can't accidentally put a key in the wrong lock and then have to start your entire save file over again. It's not that <laughs> bad. Because that was genuinely a problem with the Water Temple in Ocarina of Time. If you put that key in the wrong lock, the way it was designed... Oh, would you look at that? He ran off, didn't he? Well, no, he wasn't heavy enough anymore. <laughs> oh, the wind. Okay. Yeah. yeah. That's a problem. It goes down faster whenever I'm like that. Wind gonna blow them away. You know what won't get blown away though? There's that room that I just unlocked, and there's this room, so. that 300 back just in rupees mm -hmm. and chess and not in chess and jugs that's still not right that's not a jug uh, pots whatever <laughs> yeah vases vases <sighs> oh gonna be one of those days is it? urns i guess you could call urns them. yeah whatever pieces oh, there's of a chest pieces of ceramics there we go. I don't know how you're going to get over there. Not quite sure either, actually. <laughs> There's a red thing over there. I don't know if we can get to it. Mm, yeah. That's one of my next steps. <laughs> also, those are a thing. <sighs> I haven't seen you in a while. Wow. Remember those all the way back in the forest yeah. temple? It's gonna be 
nervous about these now. <laughs> Okay, it's mildly satisfying whenever... and I know how to get through the room, so... Designed that just for that to happen. At least a couple of times to someone just to get that clinch moment. Yep. Oh. Uh oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> the other ones fell off nicely. That one decided to hold on a bit. <laughs> oh, this is genuinely making me clinch. It's like. <laughs> they make you work for that one, don't they? Yeah. Oh, <laughs> speaking of work for. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, boys. Mm. <gasps> oh, these. Okay, fine. <laughs> Oh, goodness. We totally just killed one by making yeah. him fall off. sure what I'm supposed to do with that. Probably will. Oh. I don't, I don't know which one you have. <laughs> Whichever be. one. Yeah. Is that going to follow that log? <laughs> one of those rare times that I forget the timer again. 
And with that, I gotta wrap this one up. If you want to follow all of our other Let's Plays, go to tscn.tv slash play. And until next time, play on and see you guys. Bye, have fun. This has been a production of the Samcast Network. tscn.tv What's your passion?